Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm making slow cooker Easter ham. Alright guys, I'm starting out. I'm using my Ninja with the slow cooker setting, but you can very easily use a slow cooker. I have a nine pound hammer. I had to cut it to fit in here. I just trimmed it around and threw the pieces in there. That's the way my mom always made her Easter ham and this is how I make it. I also make it this way for Christmas. I'm going to take a can of pineapple chunks, juice and all, and dump them in here. You just want to spread them around down in there. To knock him down so my lid goes on. All right, now I have a jar of maraschino cherries. I'm going to dump them in juice and all. Just get it down in there. And it's going to give it a really good sweet flavor. And some people might say, hey, that sounds kind of gross, but trust me, the sweet with the ham is really good. Now I normally use orange soda, but the store was all out, so I got lemon lime soda. That'll work just fine. And I'm just going to dump some down in here. And I'm going to try not to dump it on the ham because we don't want to wash that cherry juice off of there. And you want to put about a cup in there, guys. I'm just eyeballing this. Put a little more in. All right. Now what my mom used to do, she used to take clove and stick pineapple rings on the ham. She'd bake it in the oven but I don't go through all that fuss. Now I'm going to put some uh, brown sugar in here. And you just want to be generous with it. And even though this isn't good for Holly's sugar, her diabetes, it is Eastern. She likes to splurge every now and then. And she's just going to get some ham. Well, not a whole lot, so she'll be all right. And I'm going to put about five or six tablespoons of brown sugar in here. And this will melt down over the ham. And my son's up getting a shower and he's blasting music in the bath bathroom. So if you hear that, Please excuse that. And guys, real quick, I want to give a shout out to my friend Bob and Sue over Lucky Dog Productions. Their channel is growing. They do all kind of neat pressure cooker videos and they go uh, exploring different places, public parks and events. I'll put a link to their channel down in the description bar. Check them out, guys, because they really could use the help and I appreciate the support for them. All right, now I'm going to set this to pressure cook on high for four hours. You could also do it on low for like six or eight hours. So I already have it set for four hours on high. I'm going to put my lid on here. We're going to let that go for four hours, and then I'll bring it back when it's done. All right, guys, my four hours is up. My ham is done. Let's get this out of here and fix up a plate and see what we got. All right, guys, I went ahead and made all the extra fixings to go with this some mashed potato stuffing, carrots, and sweet potatoes. And I threw some of that pineapple and cherry on the ham. So you go ahead and put some of that juice on there if you like. But I'm not going to. Let me taste my ham. It's nice and tender, guys. It's infused with the flavor of the pineapple and cherry and the soda and the brown sugar. That's really good, guys. All right, there you have it. Slow cooker Easter ham. Give it a try. Thanks for watching, and happy Easter, everybody.